Hi everyone, to the bone, this is Darcy, and today I'm doing my first Sephora VIB sale recommendations. I'm excited to create this video for you guys because all the products I'm mentioning today are my holy grails, totally worth the purchase. Some of them I'm gonna be repurchasing, especially during this time of year with this sale coming up soon. So if you wanna see my recommendations, keep on watching. But before we get to the video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the little bell next to the subscribe button so you won't miss any of my future videos. And now let's get to the video. The first product is actually a primer. I never really was the type of person to use primers. I've used very few in my life, but I'm in love with this one that I tried and I'm definitely gonna repurchase. This is from Origins and is the Origins Skin Pore Perfecting Cooling Primer with Willow Herb. This is amazing. It's super cooling and has like an interesting texture, if you guys can see. It has like this moussey texture and what I love about it is that it's cooling, so it's amazing for the summer and also it closes up your pores and helps the makeup apply really nicely and it has also a very like faint tint. And on no makeup makeup days, I kind of use this just by itself because it has a little bit of a tint and it's mattifying and it helps to like blur out the pores and the fine lines. So it's a really good makeup primer that you can also use as just your regular base if you like on more like natural days. So definitely highly recommended. All the products I'm gonna be also leaving on the description box below. Next thing is foundation. And I have a few foundations that I use, but this one has like blew all of them out of the water. And it was actually a recommendation that I got from Jaclyn Hill. I love her channel as well. And she, highly recommend this product and after I got it I literally have not used any other foundations. This is the Dior Forever and I use the shade 14. There's only one thing I don't like about this foundation is that it oxidizes but the way around that is to if you decide to buy this foundation definitely go to the Sephora store try it on your face first your regular shade and a lighter shade and walk around the store and then wait about 10 minutes and look in the mirror and then you see which shade you are truly because from Dior foundations I'm usually a little darker but I had to go a little lighter because it oxidizes so definitely be careful when you Purchase foundation online, make sure you check out at the store first. After it oxidizes, it doesn't change color anymore. It's just change colors within the first 10 to 15 minutes. So be careful on that if you're gonna get it online. Even though it oxidizes, it's still the most amazing foundations I have ever tried because it lasts all day, close out my pores, it's full coverage, but it doesn't look like full coverage. It looks like real skin. It's actually what I'm wearing today on my face and is mostly what I use whenever I wanna get glammed up, if I need a full coverage, if I'm doing like a full makeup look. But I highly recommend it because it's totally worth it. It is one of my, is my holy grail foundation. So check it out, Dior Forever. Now let's talk about highlighters. It's one of my favorite categories. The first one I'm gonna talk about is the limited edition Anastasia Beverly Hills with Amarezzi. This is a collaboration from Anastasia Beverly Hills with a YouTuber called Amarezzi. This is limited edition and it's amazing. I probably own almost every single highlight ever made and I keep purchasing more, but I'm glad I purchased this one because it's definitely different. I mean, I know we all say that about every single highlight, but this one, when I say it's different, is because the color, this is not just buttery, it's almost like a gel-like and see how it it just blends so beautiful. So it's a good highlighter for people that like a ba-bam highlight and also the people that like a soft highlight. It all depends with the brush that you use and how you apply it. I actually have it on today. That's the highlight I'm using today and I'm obsessed. I'm so glad I got it because I own a lot of highlighters in my life. It's a category I can never get tired, but this one I don't have anything like in my collection. It's more like of a white gold and is, I'm happy because a lot of the other gold highlighters, I can't really use it because it becomes too dark for me. So this one, I think it looks really great in all skin colors and is a limited edition. So it's a perfect thing to get during the sale right now because it's limited edition. So it's totally worth it. The second highlight I'm gonna be talking about is also limited edition. But again, during the sale, you wanna definitely get the things that are available now in April, 2018. And this is from Becca and it's called Parisian Lights. This is a collaboration with Becca and a YouTuber called Sananas. I feel like this one should be a permanent because it's so gorgeous. I'm gonna swatch for you guys now. It's not just gorgeous, like beautiful, like the art having the Eiffel Tower, but it's gorgeous color, guys. It's rosy and gold at the same time. It's supposed to mimic the 
magic hour by the Eiffel Tower at the end of the days in Paris. And I don't know, I love it. I again don't have anything like it in my collection and I own a lot of highlighters, but I don't have anything like it. And it's limited edition, so totally worth to check it out. Now let's talk about eyeshadow. And I'm gonna start with the one I'm using in my eyes right now, which is amazing. I am in love with this eyeshadow. I just literally have never felt this way about any eyeshadow in my life before. I am not a makeup artist, I'm a makeup lover, and I am in love with Pat McGrath. And this, actually two palettes that I got from her. One is the Platinum Bronze and the other one is the Bronze Ambition. I'm actually using Bronze Ambitions in my eyes right now. That's what I'm wearing. And I actually shot a video of my first impressions creating this look that I'll post later on during the month. But I'm in love with this palette. Most of all, because the colors are so basically goof proof. I feel like the concept of eyeshadows blending themselves came from Pat McGrath because they just blend themselves. I love the looks I came up with these palettes and if you have a chance, definitely get them doing the sale because they're up there in price. This one I think is like $55, but the colors are just gorgeous, first of all, and the pigmentation is unbelievable. It's so buttery and they blend themselves, no joke. Platinum bronze and it's also gorgeous. By the way, these are limited editions, so I did not get them on the sale only because I was afraid they were gonna sell out and I wanted to try Pat McGrath so bad. But now, during the sale, if you have a chance, get them because they may sell out for sure since it's a limited edition palette and the price is up there in price, but still a lot more affordable than other Pat McGrath palettes. So if you get anything from this video, get these because you won't have another chance. And I love that, I'm so happy I got it. Now let's talk about Viseart. And this is also limited edition. I'm talking about a lot of limited edition palettes and makeup and things because this is the time to get it. They're, they're out, they're at Sephora, they're limited edition and they're worth it. So this is from Viseart and is the Trist palette. I've been using it quite a lot. I actually have a tutorial coming up also on my channel with this palette and it's gorgeous. Not just for the color selection, it's so beautiful. I use this palette a lot of the highlight Parisian lights because it has this like golden, romantic, beautiful look, especially for the spring or for weddings or anything that requires like a beautiful romantic look. And it's so beautiful too, like with this rose gold package. It's gorgeous. And I have a tutorial coming up with this palette so you guys can see it on, on action. Check it out. Other two palettes that I got from Viseart, which are not limited editions, so you can get this all year round, which I'm so thankful, is the Theory palette. This is the Siren one, and this is the Absent. And I actually purchased them from Muse, but now they're available at Sephora. I did not know they're gonna be available at Sephora so soon, otherwise I would have waited for the sale. But I'm glad I didn't wait for the sale because I was excited to get these two palettes because I was so in love with the Trist palette that I wanted to try more Viseart eyeshadows and this one just came out and I thought the colors are very different. I don't have anything like it in my collection, so I wanna check it out. So the Siren one is a more peachy tone one, just again, very spring. Viseart is that type of eyeshadow, just like Pat McGrath, that blend itself, so buttery. And a lot of the Viseart shadows are super expensive, like most of their palettes is like $80. This one is $45 and it's cheaper because it's, you know, as in a smaller pan, there are other pans like 12, I think, and this one has six. So it's worth to check it out. Another thing I like is that the eyeshadow actually come out. I love that it has like this magnet so you can just pull it out, make your own, and then travel with it or add your like makeup kit. Fizzy Art is actually target to professional makeup artists, but it's so amazing for everybody else because they also blend themselves, they have buttery, they're Gorgeous, and you're gonna see on my other tutorial how I use the Trist palette and how they perform amazing. And this one is also the new release and called Absent, and it's also part of the Theory collection, not limited edition, which is good, you can get it anytime, but it's great to get it during the sale because now they're available at Sephora. And Sephora has other colors from the Theory colors, but those are the newest ones that just came out this spring. Now let's talk about mascara, and I have two recommendations for you guys that are amazing. This one is Monsignor Big from Lancome. 
Actually, I got this for free with the 100 points from Sephora. They might still have it. So if they still have it, you can add 100 points and get this for free during the sale. But if they don't have it, I highly suggest to get either the travel edition, which is this one, or the full size, which I'm definitely going to get it because I'm in love with this mascara. This is the mascara I'm using it today. So it gives you almost like a fake eyelash look. So I have this on almost all day and it's still good. Like it still looks pretty good. It doesn't smudge, it doesn't flake. I love it. So Monsignor Big, definitely a good choice for the sale. Another one, the Old Bagooty is my Benefit The Real Tinted Primer. And I've mentioned this before on my channel because I still use this for many, many years. I'm actually almost running out of it. So I'm gonna get a replacement on this sale as well because it's amazing. It's very, very, it's a tinted primer, but it's brown. And you, you're supposed to use this before you put mascara on, but I like using this by itself because it actually has like vitamins, so it's good for, my, for your eyelashes. And it looks so beautiful. It looks like your eyelashes, but better. It makes your eyelashes darker and fluffy and beautiful. Like I use it all the time during the day and whenever I'm doing like no makeup looks because it just looks beautiful. I feel like I don't need to put any more mascara on top of it. So it's one of those things that I've been using for many years and I'm still using it. It's one of my holy grail mascaras and it's not even a mascara, it's a tinted primer. You can use it in a primer as well, like before you put a mascara, which also works, but by itself is amazing. So I'm actually gonna repurchase because this one it's fairly old and it's almost done. So now let's talk about lips. The first one is the Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss. And it's just a regular lip gloss. I think it's the only one that they have. They released it a long time. And as you guys can see, I don't know if you can see on camera, I've used quite a lot of it. It's like up to here. And for me, this is a lot. This is actually what I'm wearing today. I'm gonna reapply so you guys can take a look. It's so beautiful. It's so gorgeous it tastes amazing it has a very nice sweet taste to it and the color guys look at this this lip gloss it's literally my favorite of all time and it's constantly on my purse and whenever i don't use this i use this one but i would say if you're gonna pick one of the two pick up this one because they're very similar but this one i find myself more attracted to i'm always on my purse I love this lip gloss and Rihanna mentioned that this lip gloss is supposed to be the best lip gloss for all skin tones and I believe her this is amazing and I don't I've never had a lip gloss I like the most it's not goopy it's super beautiful and always looks amazing so this is literally permanent on my purse and I will continue buying it when I run out but let me swatch it on my arm so you guys can see it too besides on my lips because I have it on my lips a little bit of a lip liner the second one is Marc Jacobs gloss on pretty things this is so good it also tastes delicious the color goes with everything and I also have used quite a lot of it and I'll swatch it next to the Rihanna one so you guys can take a look about the difference but it's a little more rosy in color than the Rihanna one. The Rihanna one is a little more brown. This one has a little more rosy tones. They're both nudes. I find that whenever I don't use this one, I'm using this one. So those are like the two favorite lip glosses that I'm completely in love right now. If you can get any of these two, you will be super happy. We have two more products for makeup. It is now makeup removers, which are something I'm gonna definitely repurchase is the Lancome by Faisal by Faisal Double Action Eye Makeup Remover. And as you guys can see, I am basically out of it. As you guys can see, this is definitely something that is on my Sephora list to repurchase because it's amazing. I've actually been using this for many years, I think for over 10 years. This is the only, only uh, makeup remover that removes like my eye makeup so quickly. When I, whenever I don't use this, I can also use olive oil or any oils, which I have a video that I show how I remove my makeup. But if I don't want to do olive oil, or if I don't want to do any other uh, natural makeup removers, I use this one because it contains water and oil, so super gentle on the eye. It says eye makeup remover, but I use it all over my face because it removes the makeup so quickly and it just leaves you such a soft, doesn't break me out, and I'm definitely repurchasing. As you guys can see, I'm basically done. Another one that I also like is from Fresh is the Soy Face Cleanser. This one I have in a smaller size because I actually got this 
on a perk as well, but I had the bigger size that I ran out. So I'm going to be repurchasing this as well during the sale. And this is the type of one that I like to use it all over my face and also removes eye makeup really well, but you have to wash it off. This one you don't. You can just use that as you are lazy, they laying down in bed and taking it off. So this one is my lazy one. And this one is one I'm really up to taking my makeup off and then go to the bathroom and I'll do my thing. So this one you apply all over the face and scrub and you can do it in your eye area and then you wash it off and removes everything and leaves the face super soft. And it's from Fresh, it's a soy face cleanser and I'm definitely repurchasing during the sale as well. Now let's talk about hair and I have just four little things to talk about so it'll be quick and they're amazing is the Dry Bar Detox Dry Shampoo and the Dry Bar Detox Dry Conditioner. Holy grails, this one is so amazing. I use it quite a lot because I don't wash my hair that often because I have long hair, it takes me forever to dry it out and style it. So since I found out the Dry Bar Detox Shampoo, I been raving about it to my friends. I got so many people to use it, I love it. And it does give a little bit of a white cast, but you have to like just jig jiggle a little bit. The scent is amazing. My boyfriend loves the scent and it makes my hair not just cleaner looking but also gives like a nice volume so if you haven't tried the detox dry shampoo from dry bar you should definitely try it it's amazing another one from dry bar that not many people talk about and i actually ran out of it completely is like completely empty is the detox dry conditioner and not many people talk about this one it's really interesting because it is a dry conditioner so you apply at the ends of the hair and it gives such a beautiful shine and it detangles, it softens. Again, since I don't wash my hair as often, like maybe twice a week or once a week, you know, I like to use the dry shampoo and this at the ends because it just kind of like smooths it out, detangles, and gives a beautiful shine. So those are two amazing products to try for your hair during the sale. Another product for the hair that is amazing, and actually I tried a sample first that came with a beauty box that I had, is the Brioche Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. And Briogeo is a brand that I've seen a lot on YouTube and people talk about it, but I never had used it myself. And I see that they sell a Sephora. And I've got this on a beauty box and I tried it and it's really good. So this is one of the things that is on my list at the Sephora sale that I will be purchasing. And I definitely suggest to try it out because it's a really good one. So it's good for dry hair, colored hair, and they don't have like silicones or parabens or sulfates. So it's like a clean brand. So I really like that about it too. So I'm definitely try it out and I'm gonna be buying the full size during the sale. The last thing is like actually like a hair uh, band that they sell at Sephora. It's like telephone, like the old telephone like thing. But I love this one because one, it doesn't give me a headache when I put it on and it keeps my hair tight. It's like transparent and I'll leave the name on the description box below with all the links for everything I talked about in this video because I can't remember the name of it, but I have it all over my house. I have it on my purse. I have it at work. I have it in the car. I have so many of those little things and I love them. This is like the best invention I think since the beauty blender because it doesn't give me a headache when I put my hair up and it doesn't like it, it keeps the, the bun tight so it doesn't like, I don't have to keep putting, you know, adjusting. So it's really good. I really, and it's like eight bucks, but I feel like it's something to try it out if you're like, you know, if you want to try something for your hair, if you have long hair and you struggle having your hair up. My hair is really heavy, so not a lot of, I cannot use a lot of the hair bands because it just keeps falling off, you know. So this one is such a great find and it's really cute. They have different colors too, but I wanted to throw in for you guys so you know because I love it so much. I highly suggest you guys try it out. So, and I'll put the name on the description box below. Thank you so much for watching guys. Sorry the video was so long, but I had so many products to recommend for you guys that I really truly love and they're totally worth it. Check it out during the sale. I have actually other products that I could talk about, but I'm probably going to talk about them on another video closer to the November sale because then you guys have other suggestions of high-end products or products that I love. But if you want to see more recommendations, more skincare recommendation or specific recommendations that I haven't mentioned in this video, please comment below and I'll be happy to do another video for you guys. I had such a good time shooting this video. I love talking about products that work for me and I love giving you guys things that work. And I'm not saying you have to buy all the things I mentioned on, on this video 
to have good skin or good hair, you don't. You can actually do with natural skincare or of anything, you don't need it. But if you are looking for recommendations, this is a good place to start because those are products I truly believe and have used and loved. And also let me know what are your recommendations because I love trying new products as you guys can see and I love recommending but I also love getting recommendations. So feel free to do your own recommendations on the description box below so I'll make sure to add to my wish list for Sephora sale as well. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!